more information about students being dropped off at the wrong bus stop after school. Yeah, on Wednesday we told you about a five year old girl who was left at the wrong location. That was an A Leaf ISD. The school district there said its bus driver did not follow the proper transportation protocol and will no longer drive for the district. Tonight, Aldean ISD is addressing the same safety concerns. A student in that district ended up on the wrong bus and was dropped off at the wrong location. KPRC 2's Devin Clark is live in North Harris County with that story. And Devin, this little girl is six years old. Six, Keith and Daniela, just a few years older than a toddler. And after her first day of school, her parents waited for her right behind me where the bus was supposed to drop her off. But when she wasn't on it, the mom went scrambling and found her little girl miles away, alone and shaken. We sent our daughter off to school. Everything seemed to be fine. But when Eric Reynolds' six-year-old daughter Olivia didn't come home from her first day at Anderson Academy, he says the bus driver uttered words that made his heart drop. Goes and check every aisle just to make sure and say, so, yeah, your daughter did not get on the bus. He says his wife immediately scrambled to find her. She just so happened to see my six-year-old daughter on the corner of Garden City Apartments. Two miles from the bus stop where little Olivia should have been left. That zip code alone has over 3,300 uh, sex offenders. Olivia's parents say she suffers from a condition where her body doesn't produce the stress relieving hormone. So she cannot be left in stressful situations like that. And um, so this has greatly impacted her. Um, She's, she's traumatized. The family believes this happened because the bus driver did not check to make sure that she was on the right bus and her teacher failed to fill out a bus tag with information that could have prevented this from happening. He says her distasteful response made matters even worse. And when she came in and you know and she was like bagged up in the corner and lying and and see, finally, when she got back up to the corner, she was like, well I'm, well, I'm sorry. But with Houston being a major hub for sex trafficking of minors, Reynolds says sorry isn't good enough. In a statement, Aldean ISD says that it's removed Olivia's teacher from further dismissal duties for the rest of the year and that the transportation department has taken corrective action against the bus driver. But Reynolds, who is pursuing legal action, says he wants everyone involved fired and he thinks that the school should equip all students with tracking devices so that this never happens again. We're live in North Harris County tonight. Devin Clark, KPRC 2 News. Oh, scary for any family. Devin, thank you for that story.